it's Manila, and that's what it's like. Kuya's afraid of escalators, especially big ones like this. We're too high up. He's scared. Kuya, don't be scared. Look at that tree. Oh my gosh. All right, so we're here at One Eye Island Mall today because we are going to get some very special cookies that have flown across the ocean. I love that cookie. You can't give it away. Yes, I can. Well, first we need to find them. The sounds of Christmas music. I'm so excited. We haven't been to this mall yet, so this is new, very different, but I have a feeling we're gonna see Salama cookies somewhere in here. And if you've been watching our vlog for a while, you would know that we met uh, Mike Francis and Salama Cookies a couple years back when we were in California um, out in Long Beach. So I'm about to sneak up and surprise them right now. What's up, buddy? <laughs> How you doing? Good. How are you? Good. He's so excited. He's Look at this. Growing. Oh my gosh. What's up, man? How are you? Look at it. Sold out. Sold out. Yeah, that's sold crazy, huh? out. Mike reserved our cookies for yeah. us yesterday. Of course. Woohoo! Because I was I was messaging him last night. We've been trying to get here for two days. The whole situation with a grab in oh, Manila right now is absolutely like nuts. <laughs> I just learned a new Tagalog word today. Cha'a. Delicious iced tea. Masara. How many samples have you had? This is my second sample. What, what are you drinking exactly? Iced tea, it's really good. I've had a classic flavor so far and it tastes pretty good. What's next door? Jabronis! <laughs> Look, our favorite pizza people are here! Mmm, we love jabronis. What's the per, per slice price? Okay, look at that. So we were fortunate enough to get to try jabronis earlier. This month, November, end of November, hands down some of the best pizza I've ever had here in the Philippines. It is real New York style cheese pizza. They got this vodka sauce, this pepperoni, it's so good. And this one with the truffle on it, oh, it's amazing. We'll be back for pizza later. <laughs> Thank you. I've got to walk around. There's so much to see out here. There's a Rebel Bakery pop-up. We've heard so many good things about them, so I feel like I'm gonna have to get some of that. Brian has actually been talking about Rebel um, so much, and I've heard about them. I don't know enough to know what is the best. What is this Ube Macapuno Pan Suisse and a Leche Plan Danish? I think we're gonna have to get a few, right? Whatever. Maybe all. Maybe all. Yeah. We can refill my GCash. Look at your pretty jewelry. Oh my goodness. They do have a live uh, singer over here and I'm seeing some really cute little tables and stuff so maybe we could grab a bite to eat, maybe some pizza, sit over there. Obviously we gotta have some cookies but more jewelry. This is what I told Brian I wanted for Christmas was jewelry and jammies. I think we've got almost all of our Christmas shopping done already. I think there's just a few more things I probably need to pick up. Yes, darling. I love you too. Don't squeeze me too hard. Did you see all the pretty jewelry for mommy? No. No? Okay. Well, you remember what remember what um, you're supposed to tell daddy what mommy wants for Christmas? Jewelry. Yes! I'm vlogging right now! Say hi! hi. <laughs> we just saw subscribers! Found some doggy treats that we want to take over to our friend's house for Christmas. I think Charlie will like the treats. You think Charlie will like the treats? I think, Char I think Chelsea will like the treats too. You, you're so handsome, Mr. Pogi. That's your new name, Mr. Chili Pogi. So cute, he reminds me of my Jinxie bear. The brand is sort of named after him because he's a little lion. Shih Tzu, right? Because they are a, a, a Chinese royal dog. Yeah. yeah. They're emperor's lap dog. Emperor's lap dog. Let's see what else is over here, Bunso. We should have brought our big cup, our big bag, huh? More cookies. We got coffee. Hot sauce. Hot sauce. Mike mentioned something about some Carabao ice cream over here, so I'm going to see if we can find it. Oh, they got the fried chicken ice cream, but we've already tried that, huh? Hello. Hot dogs. Ooh. Matcha, gelato made from fresh carabao milk. Wow, okay, 
definitely need to get some of this. So you want one strawberry cheesecake and one caramel milk flavor, please. Bunso, can you squeeze over? Thank you, dear. So Gcash is an app that's basically like Venmo almost, if you're used to using Venmo in the US. And all you do is scan a QR code wherever it is that you're purchasing and you can pay straight through your Gcash. You can reload it at like grocery stores. Um, we actually are able to reload it through the bank account and things like that. So it's very convenient and handy and it saves you from having to carry cash. Okay, so here's like the Gcash code and then there is the confirmation that the Gcash is sent. Thank you. Okay, boys, here's your ice creams. All right, so you're gonna put some of the buko pandayam in here. And I'm gonna add a little bit of ice cream in between it. It's like a cookie ice cream sandwich. Our buko pandan cookie sandwich. I don't know if you can beat that. That's pretty good. So adorable. I love it. It's a good thing we don't have any baby girls because me and Boon so shop enough that uh, I don't need another one to go shopping <laughs> with me. I'm walking over to Jabroni's. I'm gonna get a couple of slices of pizza, one for me and one for the Roro. Kuya is full of ice cream and cookies, so he is good. Daddy's having a poke bowl and I think we just got a winter melon milk tea to share too. So let's go get some pizza. Let me do one classic and one vodka roni. Yes, and my son uh, did a review for Jabroni's. Again, you get the crunchiness, it's super consistent, really good. The truffle pairs perfectly with this cheese, and there's a white sauce to go with all of this, which makes it 10 times better. I love this. He said it's his favorite pizza. My white pizza with hot sauce that I probably shouldn't be eating because I'm supposed to be eating very clean um, since my body is still recovering from the appendectomy, but I'm feeling okay. Just gotta wear loose clothing. so good. It's like three different kinds of cheeses, and then there's a truffle cheese, and then I had him drizzle some hot sauce on it for me. I have no idea. You don't like how it tastes? No, it's just, I don't know, it's unnecessary. For you, it's just like extra calories, extra calories, something you don't need. You just want the meat and the rice. Well, the fish and the rice. Time to eat some pizza. Tastes like pizza. Takeover blog. I don't know if have, have you guys played pickleball before? Dude, this mall's fancy. So typically our wait times when we get a grab are probably like five to seven minutes, but this one here, we got 16 minute wait, but at least we've got one. We've driven past this area on the outside. I've never actually seen what it looks like on the inside. They've got all these buses out here. It's almost like a, a drop off and a pickup station. And they got some food vendors out here too, of course. All right, we got Mr. Celso here. We finally got a grab, only 15 minutes, which was actually really good. So I'll say for the last two days, we've been trying to come out here to one Ayala and um, I think I tried getting a grab for about six hours, four to six hours. I kept trying and trying and trying yesterday and it was just no, nothing, voila. I even tried a new app called Avis Philippines where you can pre-book a ride and they were so busy they couldn't even accommodate either so I'm very glad we got Mr. Celso here to come pick us up. Grab this month has just been really rough. I, I think, think going home even it was like 11 p.m. <laughs> or 12 something like that. Yeah um, we still couldn't find a grab so we actually we've had to find to ourselves walk walking home, home from yeah. from places that are a lot farther than we normally would so I doubt we're leaving BGC for much without uh, Mr. Ramir driving us around. So it's like the one way in and out of BGC and it's always, there's always traffic. Like there was one time that we were coming back from uh, Makati and I think we sat here for like an hour and it's only, what, it's a mile and a half. Like I contemplated just getting out of the car and walking home sometimes. I actually told Brian earlier, maybe we should just walk over here to the mall, but he didn't want to walk mile and a half with the kids because they're makulit. It's Manila and that's what it's like. It's just got to be prepared and know to leave early some days, most days, and definitely for the entire month of December. We're already back home. It took us like a whole five, ten minutes to get here 
it's crazy to me how sometimes it can take that whole hour, hour and a half just to go down that small stretch of road. Our favorite volunteers over here, the cats bought gifts for the staff. So we need to get our gifts for the staff and we need to get some gifts for the cats. The boys, they love their cats. Kazen's out here loving on his favorite girl. Look at her, yes yeah, she does. Hi Laura girl. Gosh, the weather's amazing right now. It feels so good outside. I just want to come and sit out here and hang out. I'm heading out right now to meet my friend Kelly and bring her some of the delicious Salama cookies that we got earlier today because I really wanted her to try it and we just weren't able to catch each other at one Ayala earlier and I wanted to make sure she got some before they all sold out. I just love sitting out here. I should have brought the boys with me. Just sitting out at High Street South. It's nice because they've got all these new restaurants that opened up over here. We've got Olive Garden. Uh, there's a new shopping shopping spot that opened. Of course, we have Kochi over there, Bolero. There's Texas Roadhouse, Wilco Gee Brothers, Oro Chocolate. There's just so many options, Denny's. So it's really cool because it's that close. It's so easy to walk over here and just grab a bite to eat. We have lots of choices. I found my Kelly and I have you know her cookies. I mean? Hi, you're handsome. so handsome. He is good looking. You're so handsome. Hopefully she enjoys the cookies. Um, she said that her daughter is more the cookie person. So I can't wait to hear what Clara says about those cookies. That is it for me tonight. Thank you so much for watching. As always, like, follow, subscribe. Merry Christmas. Malingayan Pasco. Feliz Navidad. Salamat. And until next time. This is BGI. Do you know what you can say? Uh, no, not the band. Look at this tree. Oh my gosh. So beautiful. Oh, I love all the Christmas trees here in Manila. They're amazing. Longer than my head. Not as wide as my head.